Hey guys, what's up? It's AppoSex here, and today I will be showing you guys how to jailbreak iOS 4.0 through 4.1 and 3.2.2 on the iPad. I'll be jailbreaking, jailbreaking the iPhone 4 running iOS 4.1, so let me go ahead and show you that I am running 4.1 uh, right there. As you guys can see, I'm running 4.1. So what you're going to need to do is go ahead and go on your computer. We're going to go to LimeRain.com. Link uh, and in annotation and in the description. So it just has some basic info, but what you really need to read are known bugs, um, like beta iOS's are not supported, um, iPod Touch 2G support is coming soon, so if you have one, don't even try, and for 3G, iPhone 3G, use Red Snow. So and then here's a change log, which is also pretty important to read, but let's just go ahead and let you know Mac and Linux are coming soon, so Windows support is um, is Windows is only supported right now. So let's go ahead and go to the file that was downloaded. We're going to go ahead and hit run as administrator. Let's go ahead and minimize this, bring this over here, and we're going to hit, uh, let me bring this closer so you can see both, and we're going to hit make it rain. So it's going to enter recovery mode. It's almost as simple as black rain, but you do need to do a little work yourself. So it's going to enter recovery mode here. And then it's going to tell us to hold the home and the power button. It's basically telling us to put it in DFU mode. Let's go ahead and get rid of this. And so we're going to hold the home and power buttons for approximately 7 to 8 seconds. And then we're going to release the power button and hold the home button. So ready? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And now we're going to release the power button just like the program told us. In case you can't see it, it's okay. But if you just follow my instructions, it will work. So it says in DFU mode, please wait. And we can go ahead and release the home button right after it says that. Let's go ahead and exit out of this. It's going to exploit. And it says Comex, or your jailbreak is done. Turn it on when done. Untethered. Thanks to Comex. Uh, please go to LimeRain.com. You can read that later. I'm not going to read the whole thing. And you will get this LimeRain with a spinny logo. So let's go ahead, and I think you do have to uh, manually turn your phone back on, which I think is pretty weird. But we're going to go ahead and manually turn our phone back on, phone or iPod Touch. And just a quick note here, or just some reminders, it doesn't work on iPod Touch 2G. And um, for anyone running a Mac thinking they can just use some VM Windows or some like Parallels, it will only cause problems right now. So you really need an actual Windows computer from what I've heard. You're free to try it, and um, if your device ever gets in recovery mode, go ahead and download RecBoot. Uh, basically, link in the description, it basically just kicks your device out of recovery mode without having to restore. So a lot of you guys just say, oh wow, I have to restore some in recovery mode, when you can really kick it out and go right back to where you were. Let's go ahead and exit out of the iTunes here, and we are almost done. Taking a little while here. So exit out of this, and we're gonna go ahead and slide to unlock. There's still one more part to this jailbreak, um, and that is that we need to go ahead and my phone was already jailbroken before this, but I just wanted to show you the steps as I wanted to try it out. Basically, all you need to do is um, open up LimeRain, tap Cydia, and hit install, and um, just another quick note, after it installs, it will crash. Um, after it's like 99%, it will crash. That's fine. Reboot your device. These two icons will be white. Go in the city, uh, do a complete upgrade, and those icons will uh, get their get their color back to uh, a high-res city icon and stuff like that. So, yeah, that's it for this video. Just a uh, quick note here. I'd like to thank Brandflake Apps for um, helping me with this video. Please go subscribe to him. He does iPhone developer stuff, um, tutorials, how to make apps. So if you're interested in making apps or if you already are a developer, check out his channel right there. I'll put an annotation somewhere on the screen. Either way, subscribe to him. Check out his channel. Also, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to me somewhere up there along with Brandflake apps. And thanks for watching and enjoy your iOS 4.1 jailbreak.